What's up, guys? Finally have some gameplay, and it's Headquarters Pro. I never, ever, ever play Headquarters, but since they had to put it in the stimulus playlist, I guess I'm going to have to deal with it. And I promised you guys every single game mode this year, so... Two birds, one stone. One of the one of the birds is a douchebag. The other one's kind of getting something done, so they cancel each other out. Let's get started. Using the tar, red dot. Just trying to get holographic. Obviously, most people don't like the red dot on this gun. Me personally, I don't like it that much either. But I don't know. It's not as bad as some people put it out to be. It uh, kind of takes away some of your sight when you. Uh, or some of your vision, it kind of impairs it a little bit when you aim down the sight. But, at the end of the day, it's a red dot sight as well, so it's it's not too bad. And I would never go after the objective, I'm not going to lie, I was going to be in KD horror. But uh, I was right on top of it, so I just hopped down, grabbed it, and went back up. And just got, got my silencer, but I'm going to continue using this uh, red dot sight until I get the holographic. I, I've unlocked it now. I think I had about 30 or 40 when I played this gameplay. And uh, this video, as you see, is uh, 11 minutes long, and it probably says part 1 of 2. There will be another part, of it, which is 4 minutes and 33 seconds. And uh, it cuts off right at the exact same time. I'm just going to stop the com commentary and resume it at the uh, second part of the video. So nothing to worry about here. It'll probably be uploaded by the time most of you view this. So just click the annotation or the link or f check out my channel to find it. I'm going to be uploading this with three other games. Selvage, another Overgrown, and uh... Storm. Storm. Took me a while to figure that out. I thought I had a Crash game, but I guess I don't. But I'll probably get one soon for you guys. Uh, right there I died, but not too bad because I got all three of my kill streaks, so it doesn't bother me at all, actually. Just gives me the opportunity to start rebuilding my kill streaks and call all these in. Get some extra cushion in my uh, kill death ratio for this game, it's going to help me out a lot. Uh, I still haven't unlocked. I think, actually, I think I have, but I kept it at 357. Just. Just because I either forgot or... I guess that's the only reason. Because I forgot or I haven't unlocked it yet. But right there I called in a Predator missile while having the Harrier out. The only reason I did that is because it seemed like the perfect opportunity. I had a Claymore in front of me. I figured I'd just lay down and do it. But most of the, most of the time I probably wouldn't do that when I have a Harrier in the air. Or a Pavlo or an attack helicopter. Any kind of lethal kill streak. So you'll see that I'm just waiting. Kind of got the air support in the air. I don't really want to go out too much. It's really hard to KD or uh, sorry, not KD horror, uh, sound horror. But I'm not a huge sound horror horror, but uh, I try to. People say like they they can sound horror perfectly, but I I don't know. Doesn't seem to work for me. Maybe it's my headset. I I have the cheapo X ones. So maybe that's it. Maybe I need to upgrade. I don't know. I kind of bought the headset for to not make any noise at night rather than uh, to sound horror. But I try to use my ability. But I think it's more of a search and destroy uh, tactic. And watch this. <laughs> that's awesome. And right there you saw that I didn't spawn. Whenever I have a claymore down and I die, I do not respawn myself. I wait to respawn. And plus the uh, headquarters has, had been capped. Actually, I think it was capped while I was watching the kill cam. So it was kind of bad on my part, but it got me a kill anyways. So Look how lucky this kid gets. I never, ever, ever get that lucky. Ever. Whenever a guy sees me and I and switching my weapon, I die. And watch, this guy has a shotgun in close quarters, but for whatever reason, he's like, oh, let's pull out the other gun. And he dies. Such a bad move. But it doesn't bother me. I don't care at all. I'm pretty sure we lose this game. Actually, I think we win. 
my teammates were pretty good, but they caught some and yeah, they defused or not defused, but capped them back and destroyed them, whatever. And here I see two care packages, and I'm hoping, oh, they're not guys, not beer, but nearby, but he is. <laughs> and uh, he takes two. I guess the sentry gun isn't so bad, but he takes a resupply, which he might have been out of ammo, but I doubt it. Uh, if you have a resupply, a counter UAV, a UAV, an EMP, that's about it. Anything that rewards your entire team, or just a crappy resupply, let your teammates have it, it'll give you points. And uh, actually a guy commented saying that if you give an EMP away, it'll give you 750 XP, so... Hmm, do I want to be able to flip the switch to call it in to make me myself feel cool, or would I rather get 750 experience and still get the EMP for our team? It's a no-brainer. Just friggin' let your teammate have it. If your teammate doesn't pick it up within 30 seconds or whatever, then take it. I don't know why they wouldn't, though. Teammates are such whores. And I'm a whore, too. Don't worry about it. I'm not saying I'm not. The TAR is probably one of my favorite assault rifles. I think I like the M16, the TAR, the AK. I'm I'm starting to become a fan of the uh, FAMAS, as you've seen in lots of my previous free-for-all videos. But I'm going to try not to bring in the same gun over and over again. That, that can probably get a little bit boring. Uh, I'm still going to try to stick with one gun for a long time, but I'll probably try to spread out the videos. Like, I'm, I'm going to be using the tower until I get uh, all the attachments, except for extended mags. Because, I don't know, I don't really feel like using extended mags. It's kind of a an attachment that uh, would be good for montage making. And I'm not going to start recording for my rewind montage until probably the end of May or June. Just because I'm, I'm lazy. Extremely lazy. So uh, the KD in the following matches, uh, the following four matches, is not superb. It's not what I like to go shoot for, but I'm gonna try to try to like put down my uh, my standard just so I can bring you guys more games. I'm gonna try to stick with a four or five KD. I used to try to stick with six, but I don't know. I don't I don't play this game as much anymore. It's I prefer to do that. Right here I see a guy pull out a laptop. If you see that happen, don't do it or else this will happen. Ah! Son of a bitch. <laughs> so yeah, that's that's too bad. And yeah, I, I say so yeah. Or um yeah. I, I despise it when people say that, but you know, I can catch myself saying it myself sometimes. So It's really just... A bad human habit, I guess. Try not to say it. it. It bothers me and it makes you sound unprepared and whatnot. And right, or really soon, I'm about to get out shotgunned. The striker, you have to be extremely close quarters or be Excalibur's to be able to do good with it. It's It's got a, an enormous ammo pack, but it it, it does low damage. It'll take three or four hits sometimes, which is ridiculous. And the range is very short on it. So people see the ammo stack in it. I think it's... I know I'm going to be wrong when I say this, but it's like 8 or 12 bullets in a regular size clip. Extended mags is just ridiculous, I'm guessing. I kind of want to get it now just to try it out. But, uh... Shit, what was I saying? So people see it and say, oh my gosh, it's amazing when really you're getting gimped out of other shit like range and power. So take into account everything about a gun before you decide it's the best one to use, you know. Right here, I'm on 23 and 5 and I'm saying, alright, don't die anymore. 5 is my death. It's, my, it's like my death count that I like to stay at. Once I get to 5, I want to stop dying. You know, of course, I always try to do less than 5, but 5's kind of... I like getting any amount of kills and 5 deaths. Unless it's under 5 kills. But if I get 5 deaths in one game, I'm happy no matter what. Usually. 
So I try to hold it back. Try to rebuild my kill streak. Get one. This is a good tactic just to camp the HQ, let enemies run in and get kills on them. I'm not much of a uh, an objective based player unless I'm doing the sabotage rush tactic. So I'm calling the UAV. Bad move on my part calling in the UAV right after it was caught or uh, captured. I'm not sure if I called it in before or after, right before, right when it was captured, but uh, bad move. Save that UAV for after. You definitely want people spawning when you have a UAV up. It's just a waste. Right now I think I'm going to call in the Predator Missile. My Predator Missile is kind of like my way of getting the 